Hey guys, Gaston from Connecting Tennis here. Welcome to another video. Quick reminder again, I keep telling you, last week to register for the forehand week, you have the link in the description. I'm so happy because we are already over the 400 people register. So, I mean, it's been amazing. And you know what's the best thing? People register and they're already interacting with me, sending emails and telling me things, you know, problems that they have with the forehand. And we're already working before the forehand week is happening. So come on, click the link, register, let's start to, to work and to improve. So let's get to today's video. Today we're gonna talk about the low balls in the approach, okay? Balls that you probably hit and approach and go to the net from the height of your knee or lower. And I'm gonna show you just some tips on how to lift them with the hand, how to brush them, just to put them, make them deep, and then you are able to go to the net and not give away an easy ball, all right? Let's get to it. All right, so I'm gonna show you a couple of shots from here, and then after the shots, we're gonna talk a little on the things that I did. So I want you before to see what I'm doing with my hand and the finishing, okay, on the forehand to lift it. I probably put some, if I find, you know, I don't like to put so much of the pros. I like to train myself to show you the best because the pros are on a different level. All right, sometimes it's good, you know, to compare, but I, I like to show you how to perform, how to do it, and that's why I train and I keep training to show you. So I'm just gonna hit a couple of balls and then we talk more about this. All right, so you could see there from different angles how I get, I was hitting almost all the balls uh, about the service line. That's from actually from where you do it because if you are closer to the net, you know, uh, that shot would be really hard and you would have to put so much risk into it because the clearance over the net would be much tougher. So probably in those cases, you would have to do, you know, a slice or just a slice and take it more with like your continental grip, just take it and then go to a net. But from there is a perfect place to do it, even a little more behind also, it's very acceptable. So you could see there that the tip, and I wanna give you, is that there is almost no work from the legs. There's no like a forehand that you're gonna step here and hit. There is just a little, a little bend just to, to help bring the ball up because the only thing you actually need it's just make a good brushing and if you could i mean the good the people you know paying attention if you didn't just go back and watch it again the sound of the ball is very important you don't have any impact on it you only have brushing and what i was doing is just getting in now you are not gonna hit the ball all the way in front like you'd be a normal forehand you let it come a little and hit it more in the line of your front foot so here let's say i'm going to that side here i let the ball get a little I hit it, but as soon as I make contact, I just brush fast, you know, going up. I don't, I almost don't go forward. It's everything from contact, brushing up, all right? I'm gonna put after this, record it from the side. You're gonna be able to see that perfect. So watch after this talking, okay? I'm just gonna close the video with this uh, brushing up from the side. And then going to our side, same thing. I just let it come to the line of my front foot, front foot hit it and after I make contact it's a fast brushing up to make just you just need to make the clearance over the net all right if you have any questions if you haven't tried this shot just try it practice it let me know how it goes comments questions video suggestions anything leave it behind here uh, under here on the comments remember the link for the forehand week is here I will just leave you with this uh, side view thank you guys subscribe to, to the channel if you didn't Share this with your friends, you know, try to to make the community, you know, available. And, and the more people we reach, the more people I can help, you know, I can, I can help to, to transform their game. 
I'll see you guys in the next one and thank you.